Okay, so there's a book coming out. It's supposed to detail the conversations with Donald Trump. I'm not particularly interested because it would just be the same as he said, she said. Now, if there's some sort of proof of something, then I'm here for this. But, let's face it, I mean, they're probably not going to tell you anything you don't believe. <laughs> it's like, oh, Donald Trump said, you know, he's the greatest elephant of all time. And you'd be like, yep, I believe it. I believe he said it anyway. You know, so it's, it's that kind of thing. It's kind of, not to deflate the balloon, but it's like, is there anything to see here? It's not like you got detailed, secret, private conversations of the Pope. You got it of Donald Trump. He said something awful, or he said he did something awful. So, let's see what this means for Donald Trump. Uh, there he will. First card is defending. Naturally. He's probably going to call him a loser and a liar and all these type of things like he does. Five of Pentacles. He's going to be called to the carpet. There's a little sort of public scrutiny there. Nine of Swords. Anxiety. Well, I guess this is bigger than I thought. I think he's more anxious about... It coming out than when it does come out but we'll see because he's he's got nothing good so far here yes yeah, seven of swords so now here comes the theft and the lying and the backstabbing and cheating so yeah right on target well done cards ten of cups there's the harmony Here's probably where it takes a turn, so he'll be mad for a week and a half, and then somebody comes to his aid. Yeah, King of Swords, Donald Trump himself. The fear is the truth, so this book is not a lie, but he said, she said. Judgment is in the environment. Six of Wands. There's the attention. And this all ends with King of Pentacles. So there is another person here. At the very least, there is something tangible he can get out of this. Whoever he is. This is not Trump. This is somebody else. So it's probably a man who wrote this. Or a man behind the financing of it. So who is anonymous? Wouldn't you think, well, maybe not. Because it's not just their conversations, it's conversations, period. Because I'm thinking if it's that person's conversations, then you can narrow down who that is. But it's probably a lot of people. So who is anonymous? Let's do three cards. The Empress, the Hierophant, and the Fool. A woman who works for Donald Trump. At the very least, it's a person who comes up with ideas. So if it's not a woman who works for Donald Trump, it's a person who births things that he does. So this is probably someone in charge of his daily life or a person in charge of his day planner. Whoever this person is, is very close to him. You've got the fool. You've got the hierophant. The fool is Trump, the hero of Fanta's government, the empress is whoever it is. So it's a person in charge of his daily life, or it is just a woman in the White House. So what does this book mean for him legally? Because you could take something from the book and then investigate but you can't use the book as proof because the book is not proof. 
But you can investigate them based on something you heard. Like the um, Steele dossier. Which I think is still holding its weight right now. So legally, what does this mean? Seven of Cups. So we right now are in the. I use sometimes use this card right now for investigating, because it means confusion. And in order to get rid of the confusion, you would have to investigate. And you see all the cups, so you would look in them and see what's there. So then we have the Knight of Pentacle. So something tangible comes out of this. Uh, there is not just someone's account. There might be recordings or something tangible, something you can hold that has these conversations on it besides this book. The Magician. So I'm, I'm thinking fabrication here. There is something that's made up in this scenario. Because I'm asking what does this mean for him legally? Something is going to be made up. Something is either there's going to be a counter book or there's going to be a transcript of something that's put out but it's doctored. But something either on his side or their side is not completely true. Five of Swords. Yeah, there's getting away with something. Seven of Wands. There's defending. Um, five of Swords is that bully pulpit. It's just winning at all costs. The dishonor and then the defending. So, um... Trump is going to come up with something, though. This is not going to be unanswered. The Wheel of Fortune and the Nine of Swords. So, yeah, this turns bad, but it turns bad mentally. I think his his brain is his greatest enemy, just like anybody else's. So, it's going to do it to him first. The fear is justice, naturally. Naturally. Somebody in his position would fear justice. Um, his hopes is the stars. So this is um, the star. This is like hope for the future. The positive card. And his environment is the two of cups. This is whoever it is. Let's see what's behind it first. The devil. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Whoever it is, is helping him do this. It's helping him with the lie. It's helping him with the fabrication. He's going to have an answer to this. Coming straight from the little devil. Your word of warning is temperance. This is bad for you. Um, I think a lot of times him and his cronies don't actually understand what it is they're doing until after it's done. And then the rest of the world points and says, wait, did he mean to do that? You know, like the Mulvaney thing. Did he mean to say that? Did he mean to admit that on TV? When Donald Trump fired James Comey and then went and talked to Lester Holt, did he mean to say that? That's what's going to happen here. You and the little devil have got an answer to this book. I don't know what it is. If you're going to have your own book or you're going to have a press conference over it or whatever. But it's going to be bad. Your alliance. This is the temperance. This is the... It, the card actually means moderation and um, sobriety and, thing, and healing and things like that. I use it for cooperation because there's always one vessel going into another. So cooperation. This card is technically also cooperation. So whoever your little deal is with, it's probably bar, it's bad. Six of Swords, transition into something else. That's your word of solace. So this will pass, but not without doing some damage. You have the death and the two of pentacles so he struggled to balance because of a major change so this does not help your case against impeachment it does not help your case against winning over the rest of the raw meat eaters who vote for you it doesn't help this book has got your um got you by the short hairs as they say
So why the book? Let's do four cards. Why the book? Get this one. Money. King of Swords. Hermit. <laughs> Tower under there too. Um, it is meant to burden him. Simply put, it's meant to burn it and isolate and make money at the same time. Because they had a, they had the opportunity, someone, whoever the King of Pentacles is, finance this. There's the money. There's the isolation. There's the burden. There's Donald Trump. King of Swords. So, the saddest part about his presidency of, well... Not the saddest part to us, but should be the saddest part to him. All the loyalty he demanded was all fake. Mm 